What's up? It's your boy Carcino, and welcome back to One Crack News, where we try to give you everything that we can to help you out with tools in your life, education, things you didn't know. And that's what this page is really about. Um, there's been plenty of stories of people who have been homeless, but their mind was not of a mind of a homeless person. They had education. They had dreams and drive. Uh, a lot of people don't know where to put their money, uh, where their money should come from, and people want to do better. They don't know how. They never was given the tools to invest or what have you. Now, it's very hard to tell somebody exactly where to put their money because then it'd be like, well, why, where's your money? Because what's good for you might not be good for somebody else. You ever thought about that? Because a lot of people do things a little differently than the average human being. And what I mean is that you might be in a whole nother lane. You might be in, you know, investing in different type of oil and fuel pro energy projects and somebody else might be into you know health and agriculture and things of that nature so you never can tell exactly where someone is going to be or where they should be you can only assume and only give people suggestions because what works for you might not work for them if that makes any sense to you whatsoever. Hopefully it does. <laughs> now, all I can do is give you tips. It's a lot of new things happening here. Uh, people could, you know, you could buy merch like Teespring. You know, you could shop your own merch, make your own t-shirts. The companies are They'll make it, and they'll make the product once they see people are interested in buying. If you have people that are interested in buying, why you have to pay a print shop? Only when someone makes the order is the shirt actually produced. So you don't even have to handle the transactions. Those things work. You know, um, though you can... Do what Jeff Belsos do. He he made selling books online, and you know J.K. Rowling start writing Harry Potter and got lucky. Uh, you know Warren Buffett way, but it's it's people who who's not gonna come up. They came up an old different way. You could find different avenues uh different investment things that you can do like for you or for anyone break everything down into 25 percent if you have a thousand dollars on your income tax this is where you should put your money okay so if you're listening out there 25% of that money should go towards IT software services, whereas Google, Facebook, Amazon, you know, around that, invest in that. 25% should go into robotics, uh, IBM, Intel, Alibaba, things of that nature. 25% um, put that into farmer health care. You know, J&J, &J, uh, Pfizer, you know, things of that nature. And 25% should go into food and beverages, whether it's Coca-Cola, PepsiCo, Nescape, Starbucks, McDonald's, whatever. That's 100% of the money you invest. That's how it should be broken up. Never put all your eggs in one basket in business, in anything. So therefore, you can have a good start and a good future 
into investing. See, the part, the thing about investing is having money to put away that you never have to go back for to get. And as blacks, we have a bad habit of having to go back to get the money. So <laughs> please make sure that that's how investing works. You can't take it out, put it back in. Take it out and put it back in. Take it out and put it back in. Once you take it out, you've already ruined <laughs> almost everything you've done. So believe me, when you put money in and investing, just count that money as money that you're not knowing about. It's gone. Don't worry about it. There's other money you got to worry about now. So just put your focus into that. Okay, so hopefully that helps a couple of people. Until next time, I'm out.